iDef exclusive news. We are at Tubitak Sage booth and we are with Mr. Gülcan Okumuş. Uh, Mr. Okumuş, do you have a new project or product for iDef? Uh, yes, we are he here at iDef 21 with our some new products. Uh, we are now focusing on mainly on our Kuzgun project. Uh, the new mainly focused on uh, unmanned air vehicles for UAVs, but it will be also uh, usable with uh, fighters and other platforms. Uh, also, we are here with our new Gözde and Gökçe precision uh, guidance kits. Mm -hmm. uh, they are transformed from HGK-82 and HGK-83. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, they have new abilities, new capabilities. Uh, they have uh, new uh, R-Jamgos uh, laser uh, seeker mm -hmm. uh, and also they will be uh, capable of uh, for uh, moving uh, Target. targets yeah, for en engagement of moving targets. You also mentioned Ramjet engine Gökhan missile, air-to-air -air missile. Uh, I mean, uh, mm -hmm. could you tell a little bit about this? We, we have uh, really much experience from the Gök2 project on air-to-air -air missiles. Uh, we also have a project, a Ramjet project, uh, and uh, up to now uh, we made about uh, firing tests more than 200 uh, for our Ramjet. Uh, so we will integrate uh, our air-to-air -air missile with uh, our Ramjet. Uh, it's an ongoing uh, project. Uh, in first phase, uh, we will use Gökhan with our F-16s mm -hmm. uh, and later on uh, we will be using our Gökhan with MMU project, our own fighter, in uh, internal bay. So, in, it will be in the internal yes. base. So, shall we understand that the Gökdoğan from the Gök2 project, which is the Beyond Horizon beyond visual, right, visual yeah. re vision a missile will be transferred to Ramjet or we will be talking about another completely new missile? I think we can say it will be a new new missile. We have the experience from the Gök2 project, mm -hmm. but uh, for specifically talking on Gökhan, it will be a new missile, a very special missile. And the uh, Gökçe and Gözde uh, guidance kits that you will use the jam Göz on it. Yeah. What are the features of it? Uh, what are the advantages that it will bring? We also have a, a very much ex we have very much experience on guidance kits till uh, year 2000. Uh, HGK 82, HGK 83, 84, uh, L uh, laser HGK uh, are already in the inventory of our uh, military. Uh, Gözde and Gökçe. Uh, have new capabilities, uh, but uh, what uh, we are mainly focusing on uh, is there they will be price effective and uh, they will have the ability uh, for the engagement of the moving objects, moving cars up to uh, 50 kilometers per hour. As far as we understand, you are also planning to use uh, to use Gökçe on the, uh, with the uh, SARP yes. 83 yes. as a penetrator yes. bomb yes. so you will be using against the shelters. Yes. So do you plan to use for a, a very long distance with a high pressure to, to reach shelters? We, we will use uh, our SARP, SARP 83T with uh, HGK 83 but now mainly with Gökçe because uh, Gökçe as a laser seeker uh, for the penetrating bombs, uh, you need very precise uh, targeting. Uh, so we will use also uh, KGK, I mean the uh, wind precision uh, guidance kit. Yes, uh, so we will be using it both with Gökçe uh, and KGK. And you also mentioned the Kuzgun, which is a modular yes. system. What are the advantages of Kuzgun? Kuzgun will be also uh, a very price-effective uh, munition. Uh, 
what makes uh, Kuzgun different? Uh, Kuzgun is specifically uh, developed for the UAVs. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, almost all the uh, munitions uh, to be taxage developed up to date can be used with UAVs, mm -hmm. with uh, higher payload UAVs like Akinci, Aksungur. Uh, but Kuzgun is uh, directly mainly focused on uh, UAVs. It will, it can be used also for with fighters, uh, but it's very modular with different seekers uh, like laser, millimeter, millimeter wave radar, uh, maybe in future IAR. Uh, also, it have modes, uh, variants like uh, turbojet, uh, rocket motor, that kind of uh, models. It will be a price effective, modular, uh, but mainly a UAV uh, munition. And when we talk about the Göktuğ project, the Göktuğan and uh, Bozdoğan, the, the, the air, air terror missiles, where are we right now? Because we just, we, last thing we heard was that they were, uh, the, the short range one was fired from a F-16 and hit the moving target on the air. Uh, Göktuğ project with Göktuğ and Bozdoğan missile uh, is very close to the finish line. Uh, the ground test finished, uh, captive fly, flight tests uh, mostly finished. Uh, there are a few tests, uh, you know, Bozdoğan uh, flight test uh, was very successful. Uh, it managed a uh, hit to kill uh, Shimshek uh, target. Uh, successfully uh, of course we cannot tell every step of the project sure. Sure, uh, but uh, what I can say we are very close to the uh, end line uh, and uh, it's 2022 and uh, I think it will be ready for the serial production by 2022 but of course uh, we will not always tell every step of the uh, project. projects and when we talk about HKG82 uh, that you are producing now with ASFAR in cooperation, it is a new model for SAGE, I believe. Can you tell us yeah. about that? Yeah, uh, it's uh, Tubitak SAGE is main, uh, one of the missions is uh, supporting the defense companies. Uh, we are uh, transferring some of uh, our uh, developments uh, to Aselsan, you know, SOM, uh, to sure. Roketsan. Roketsan is manufacturing the uh, SOM missile. Uh, also, MK, uh, MK, 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 also uh, doing the bomb. penetrating bomb. Uh, also, the wind uh, wing assisted kit is uh, manufactured by Kale Group. So, uh, we also uh, make a agreement, made an agreement with uh, Asfat. Uh, we produced, uh, they produced HGK-82 with our support, but with some uh, new additions uh, like our uh, GPS receiver Kashif. So we like that model. Uh, we are happy with that model, and I think uh, we will we will have new uh, projects with Asfat, but also with other uh, defense companies, uh, with big ones like Aselsan, but with also uh, smaller ones. So is there any new project that we should be waiting in that model to come up soon? Uh, we are working on some uh, projects. Uh, maybe the name will be uh, told <laughs> we will later on. Yeah, later. Mr. Okumush, thank you very much for answering our questions. Thank you very much for your visit. Thank, thank you. you. IDEF exclusive news.